Uh, hello, uh, everybody. It's, uh, it's your Uncle Henry. Uh, I'm just sitting here at Casey's under the shade tree. Got a little fuel and uh, got me some pizza. I'm going to have a little lunch. So I know Jim's been calling. Everybody's been wondering what the fuss is all about with John Deere. Well, I spoke with Wayne up there at the dealership, and I'm waiting on a call from Moline, Illinois. Uh, you know, their national headquarters to find out uh, how we're going to deal with this situation. Um, I've been gone all day. I ain't been at the farm. I've been out running around uh, just, you know, had to go to the bank, had to go here, had to go to the store, had to go to tractor supply. But it's been busy just running. It's just my day to run. So um, they were supposed to come by the farm and talk to me. I, I, I didn't even I didn't even want to talk. I didn't even want to see those guys. I'm, I'm just so pissed off right now. But uh, you know I'm. I don't know. We'll see what uh, what's going to happen here. I'm not a hundred percent sure. Uh, might be switching tractor brands. I, I don't know. But, regardless, uh, we're still going to be farming. And, uh, you know, that, that that's not going to change. So, don't you worry about that. We're still going to be making these videos. As long as you want me to keep making them, I'll keep making them or send them over to Jim. It, it, it takes a while now to send this stuff over to Ireland, but, uh, well, I'm, I'm not smart enough to figure out how to, you know, put them on, uh, uh, on the Internet and all that junk and viruses and, you know. So, oh, hold on. Uh, my phone is vibrating here. Uh, hello. Yes. Yes, it's here. Yes. Well, hello, Jared. Well, I'm not doing too good. As, as you know, I went to my local uh, dealer and I got a, a 9R X series uh, John Deere tractor. Yes. Well, I think it was 9R I don't know. It had tracks on it and it was articulated job. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Well, it started slinging oil everywhere. No. I'm 54 year old, Jared. Just how old are you? <laughs> Boy, I got work boots older than you. Yes. Well, I want them to make it right. Make it right, I'm going to switch. I tell you what, you may not know around here, son, but there's more than one uh, dealership in this town. We got a Case IH dealer in this town, too. Well, I don't want to. I've been one of your most loyal customers. Bought my first John Deere in 1974. Way before you even thought about being born. So I suggest you watch your tone the way you speak to me. Well, I'm not trying to get ignorant, but I'm not going to have some snot-nosed punk-ass kid talk to me like that. So let's start this all over again. Hello, Jared. My name's Henry. That's better. Okay. Yes, sir. No, I don't want to switch. I like the tractors. I like everybody up there. Wayne and I had a disagreement. We didn't see eye to eye on this. You know, it's not his hard-earned money. It's mine. Okay. Well, I appreciate that. They're going to... Okay. Now, in the meantime, what am I going to do for a tractor? Latest and greatest technology. I'm listening. Okay. So the cab configuration is going to be exactly the same. It's just going to be different style tractor. Is that right? Yeah. Well, back to the farm. I got an 8R. Yep. Yep. Combine. You did what? You already talked to Wayne, and you sent him down there to replace those two pieces of equipment at the farm, and I got one tractor to pick up the dealer. 
and we're on the same page as far as service goes and taking care of the customer and everything else. Well, that suits me just fine as long as that suits you. No, no money out of my pocket. Well, no money out of my pocket, okay. I'm listening. Well, Jared, I think you just sealed the deal for this old man. No, I ain't got no problem going up and picking it up. I got a low loader trailer. Yes, sir. Well, and, and I apologize for you. you I was just kind of getting under my skin. This has been uh, this has been bugging me for a long time, and it's about doggone time we've got it taken care of. All right, you'll mail me all the paperwork. All right, sounds good. Hey, thank you, young man. I do appreciate it. Yeah, you're, no, you're very welcome. Thank you. All right, bye. Uh... Sorry about that, guys. I wouldn't. I, I, honest to goodness, was not planning on having that uh, conversation while I was recording. But uh, well, y'all ain't gonna believe this. They, uh, by God, they, they, they stuck to their word, and they're gonna take care of it. So I'm gonna let these glow plugs warm up. All right, uh, we got to get back to the house because. Jared was telling me that, uh, <laughs> well, they kind of went above and beyond, actually, guys. They, uh, they replaced a combine and my 8R with brand new equipment for my troubles. And I've got the latest and greatest tractor that they make waiting at the dealer. I just got to go pick it up. So, it went a lot better than I thought it was going to go. Oh, I better stay in my life. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. Let's, uh, let's see what we got back here at the house. Farm. Oh. I was not expecting them to do this. I was expecting a bigger fight than what I had, but. Sometimes you just gotta put your faith in people that they're gonna you know, do the right thing and everything else. So I'm curious to see. I'm kind of speed down the ground road here, but I'm anxious to see what we got here at the house. They must have done this while I was gone, the way Jared talks. Combine header, it's the same. Nothing's changed there. Let's see what we got here in the shed. It's almost like Christmas and spring. Oh my God! Look at this rascal. A 90H70 bullet rotor. You got to be kidding me, guys! I. I'm speechless. I, I I don't know what to say. That's uh, I can't believe they do something like that for me. Uh, I wasn't expecting all this. I I just wanted my tractor taken care of. Uh, well, we might as well go check out what the latest and greatest job is. We gotta pick it up anyway. Alright, uh, got plenty of uh, air 
pressure. All right. Yeah. Let's go see what we got at the shop. And as, if you heard me talk to Jared there, I, you know, I wanted to make sure it was kind of like the same cab configuration. I really did like that cab configuration, guys. I'm not joking. That articulated job there. trying to get anything extra out of those boys. I was just trying to make them you know, do the right thing. And by God, they went they went well above and beyond anything I could have ever asked of them. Tractor. That looks like some military job. Holy cow, with the big old tracks on it. So, let go out of the way here. Would you look at that? 9570RT. Holy cow, boys. Now that is a good looking tractor. I've, I've seen these jobs on, on their commercials and stuff, but I, I don't believe I've ever seen one around here. Uh, Cab configuration looks good. Visibility looks excellent. Looky there. Well, only one thing left to do. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, let's uh, put that here there. I am just 100% blown away. Can't hardly believe it. Well, this thing turns on the dime. Yeah. I don't even know if I can get this rascal up on the trailer or not. We're going to drive. Uh, 
She'll ride like that, we'll get her home. I have to take it extra easy. Definitely off to him. Every single one of them. Praying about this every night. I've been worrying myself sick over this. Uh, you know, I don't ask a whole lot out of life, guys. I, I just want to. I just want to farm and just uh, be left alone. So, uh, I'm so tickled that they went and did this for me. So that's just uh, one less thing that. I'm gonna have to worry about we can get back to work, we can get ready for you know, spraying these fields and get ready for harvest and uh, it's uh yeah, the life will be back to normal again, so Ooh wee. One last thing I have to stress over. Everything else is pretty much gonna work itself out. The crops her guys that uh, boy she is a beast 
But listen, I, I, I truly, I truly want to thank everybody for watching these videos. If it wasn't for y'all, I hell, I wouldn't even make a video. So, uh, give it one of them, you know, them thumbs up if you liked it. <laughs> you know, give a subscription over there to Jim. He'd appreciate it. And uh, well, I'm gonna get this rascal unloaded and uh, finish up a couple little small chores around the shop today. And we'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye for now.